Tonight, an update on a cat many of you have been wondering and worried about. Two weeks ago, we first told you about King. He was severely burned in a house fire, so the Nebraska Humane Society has been using fish skin to take care of him. Doctors had given him a 50-50 chance to live. Reporter Ken Lutzen went to see how King is doing now. This is King the Cat now. I don't know if you've noticed, he is meowing quite a bit right now. <laughs> So it's, it's nice to have him coming back to his normal personality. But just three weeks ago, his life was in the hands of doctors at the Nebraska Humane Society. His body covered in burns after he was pulled from a house fire. King was confined to a pen. Earlier, we told you doctors put their trust in a new treatment, tilapia skin, to help King heal. And according to Dr. Katie James, the fish treatment was a success. Tilapia skin did exactly what it was supposed to. It provided pain relief and coverage to uh, stop infection from getting in for a uh, long enough for the skin to start healing. The tilapia allowed new skin to grow back to the point where vets were able to take a skin graft from his belly and cover burned areas. Most of the spots will regrow fur. However, King could be bald in spots with scar tissue. Dr. Katie James says when King first came in, he was on about eight treatments a day. That has been cut down in half over the last two weeks. While he's been healing, King has been licking at his scabs, hence the cone. He has determined that he is the king of all of animal medical and does what he wants. He's also been coddling a paw, something doctors are keeping their eye on. It has tissue over bone, so that's all we can hope for at this point. And thanks to an unlikely ally, fish. King is still alive, energetic, oh, and yeah. keeping doctors on their toes. He's going to return to being a pretty normal cat. That's awesome. We mm -hmm. can say that with confidence. Right? Yes, yes. As there, obviously, we're not completely out of the woods yet. We still have a little bit of healing to do, but it's looking so good right now. Dr. James says they will continue to take this <laughs> day by day and hopefully send King home soon. In Omaha, Kent Lutzen, 3 News Now. Dr. James adds King will be on pain medication for quite a while, possibly the rest of his life. His family visits him often. The team at Nebraska Humane Society plans to now use this treatment again in the future.